Hey guys, real fast, I'm going to show you how to make Photoshop CS6 work on a 4K screen. I recently got a new laptop with a 4K screen, installed Photoshop CS6, and when I opened it up, I realized that it doesn't render in 4K. It renders in 1080 is the max, and these is, this is what I got, these little tiny menus and options that I cannot edit on. So I started looking for workarounds, and that's when I found a couple of registry and manifest edits that you could do, but I learned that they mess up the accuracy of the tools. So this is basically what I got. This is the selection area, and this is what actually got selected. It was a much bigger area. It was basically messing up all the accuracy of the tools. So that's when I started looking at better options. And that's when I realized that I could just downsize the resolution to 1080. So I tried that, downsize the resolution to 1080. And I'll show you how we do that. So you go to Display Settings. This is Windows 10. And then go down here to Advanced Display Settings. And you go down here, and we're going to cut our quality in half to 1080, which is what Photoshop renders in. So I click 1080, and we're going to hit Apply. All right, now the screen is showing 1080. So we're going to try and open Photoshop again, and you're going to see it's still loading in 4K. You can see how teeny tiny it is. So basically, Windows is operating in 1080, but for some reason, Photoshop is still rendering in 4K. So this is how you're going to fix that. Right-click on the Photoshop emblem, go down, hit Properties, Compatibility, and then we're going to hit Check right here, Disable Display Scaling on High DPI Settings. So we're going to click that, hit Apply, OK. Now we'll open up Photoshop again. There we go, much bigger. And when it pops up, all correct, accurate size menus. And we'll, we'll actually we'll open a new one here and show you that the tools are working correctly. So you can see there it is. Everything is accurate. Everything's working right. It cuts your quality in half, but this is what Photoshop CS6 is meant to work in. All right, thanks for watching. Hope that helped. And be sure to subscribe to One Minute Photography School for every week we send out a new video where you can learn a little more about photography in just quick, short videos. Thanks.